Football is more than a spectator sport. The beautiful game can unite world powers. Saudi Arabia and Iran have reached a groundbreaking deal to resume home and away football matches between clubs. Since relations between the two regional powerhouses broke in 2016, football clubs played each other on neutral grounds. But the former rivals announced a historic breakthrough early this year to resume ties after years of rocky relations. And now, governments in both countries have lifted restrictions and are instead promoting football to unite communities. President of the Saudi Football Federation Yasser al Mehsad said, This MOU would not only foster ties between our federations, but will also carve a path for our youth, women, and the entire football community to succeed and enjoy the many benefits and opportunities available through the beautiful game. This sentiment was also shared by the President of Iranian Federation, Mahdi Taj, who said, This is a truly historic day for two nations, bound by an enduring love for football, a sport adored by millions with so much potential still to explore and realize. The 2015 Asian Champions League edition was the last time Saudi and Iranian teams faced each other on home turf. This month, several international superstars on the Saudi side will kick off their Asian Champions League campaign. Anas, which features famed superstar Cristiano Ronaldo, will compete in Tehran's Azdari Stadium on September 19th against Persepolis, while Neymar's Al Hilal and Karim Benzema's Al Ittihad will also journey to Iran during the group phase. Now, with the rivals moving towards settling differences on the diplomatic front, it's time for a healthy battle between sportsmen on the pitch.